Today, I'm going to list my top 10 women's 200 meter sprinters of all time. Now, let me note that this is only for the 200 meter dash. So I don't factor in the 100 meters, 400 meters, 4x100 meters, or the 4x400 meter relay. This is also my own personal list. Everyone has differing opinions on which criteria holds more weight, whether it's world records, Olympic medals, overall consistency, etc. So go in the comments below and list your top women's 200 meter sprinters of all time. And don't forget to like the video and subscribe to the channel to keep up to date with all the future content. So with that, let's jump into the list. I'll start off with five honorable mentions before getting into my top 10. For my first honorable mention, I have Marita Koch from Germany. Now she's the world champion from the 1983 games in Helsinki, and she's a four-time world record holder. She's also the first person to ever break the 22 second barrier, which she has done nine times through her career. Her personal best of 21.71 seconds currently still stands stands as number seven all time in the 200 meters. Next up again from Germany, I have Heike Dreschler. Now she's the bronze medalist from the Seoul 1988 Olympic Games, but she has a world indoor gold medal at the 1987 Indianapolis Games. She's a world record holder, which she broke two times through her career and her current personal best of 21.71 seconds still ranks her as number seven all time. And she has gone under 22 seconds six times through her career. My third honorable mention goes to Barbara Rockle from Germany. She's a two-time Olympic gold medalist from 1976 and 1980. Her personal best of 21.85 seconds was number five all-time back in 1974 and still stands as number 20 all-time. She has gone under 22 seconds only one time through her career, but she is also ranked number one two times through her career in 1980 and 1982. Next on my honorable mentions, I have Wilma Rudolph from the United States. She won the Olympic gold medal in Rome 1960 at those Olympic Games. A personal best of 22.9 seconds hand timed was the former world record and she became the first person to ever break the 23 second barrier. In that year of 1960, she ranked number one in the world because of her performance. Finally, for my honorable mentions, I have Elaine Thompson from Jamaica. Now, she is the Olympic gold medalist from Rio 2016. She also has a silver medal from the Beijing 2015 World Championships. Her current personal best of 21.66 seconds ranks her as number five all time in the 200 meters, and she has broken 22 seconds four times through her career. Now, let's jump into my top 10. First off, at number 10, I have Raylene Boyle from Australia. She's a two-time Olympic medalist winning silver in Mexico City 1968 and then another silver four years later in Munich 1972. Her personal best of 22.45 seconds was number two all time back in 1972 and that's why I have her at number 10. Moving up to number nine, I have Daphne Schippers from the Netherlands. She's an Olympic silver medalist from Rio 2016 and has two world championship gold medals from Beijing 2015 and London 2017. Her personal best of 21. 0.63 seconds run in Beijing 2015 is now number three all time in the 200 meters. She has also broken 22 seconds on five occasions throughout her entire career and she is ranked number one in the world in that 2015 year. Coming in at my number eight, I have Renata Stecker from Germany. Now she's a two-time Olympic medalist winning gold in Munich 1972 and then a bronze four years later in Montreal 1976. Her personal best of 22.38 seconds was a world record in the event and she actually broke the world record on two occasions in her career. And she has five number one rankings throughout her entire career, so I have Stecker at number eight. At number seven, I have Betty Cutbert from Australia. Now she's an Olympic gold medalist from Melbourne 1956 and her personal best of 23.2 seconds hand timed was the former world record back in her time and she also broke the world record on two occasions throughout her entire career. Her multiple rankings cumulates with two number one world rankings throughout her entire career so that's why I have Betty Cupper coming in at my number seven. At my number six I have Gwen Torrance from the United States. She's an Olympic gold medalist from Barcelona 1992 and a two time world championship silver medalist from Tokyo 1991 and Stuttgart 1993. Her personal best of 21.72 seconds was number five all time back in 1992 and still ranks as number nine all time. She has broken 22 seconds on 10 occasions throughout her career, which is the third most of any woman in history. Also with her number one ranking from 1992, that puts her at my number six all time. Now jumping into my top five all time, I have 
Florence Griffith Joyner from the United States, two-time Olympic medalist with the silver in 1984, and then that gold medal in Seoul 1988. She also has one world championship medal with a silver from Rome 1987. Her personal best of 21.34 seconds is the current world record in the 200 meters. She has also broken 22 seconds seven times through her career, which is the fifth most of any woman throughout the entire event. She also has a number one ranking from that 1988 legendary season, so I have Flojo at my number five. Up on to number four, Veronica Campbell Brown from Jamaica is my number four. She's a two-time Olympic gold medalist from Athens 2004 and defending it four years later in Beijing 2008. She also has four world championship medals, two silver medals from Osaka in 2007 and 2009 in Berlin, a gold medal in Daegu 2011, and a bronze medal from Beijing 2015. Personal best of 21.74 seconds, which was number eight all-time back in 2000. 2008, but still stands at number 11 all time. She has broken 22 seconds five times through her career and has ranked number one in the event in four seasons throughout her entire career. So Veronica Campbell Brown coming in at my number four. Now getting into that top three, at my number three, I have Arena Shavinska from Poland, a three-time Olympic medalist in the event, silver in 1964, gold in 1968, and a bronze in 1972. Three consecutive Olympic medalists. Medals. Personal best of 22.21 seconds, which is the former world record, but she also broke the world record three times in her career. She has seven number one rankings throughout her entire career, which spanned from 1964 down to 1979. So that's why I have her coming in at my number three. Getting into that runner up spot at number two, I have Merlene Adi from Jamaica. She is one of the most decorated 200 meter sprinters in the history of the event, a four time Olympic medalist three bronze medals in 1980, 1984, and 1992, and then a silver medal in Atlanta in 1996. Nine-time world championship medalist, including two gold medals from 1993 and 1995, a silver medal from 1983, and three bronze medals in 1987, 1991, and 1997. She also has an indoor silver medal in 1987, as well as two indoor gold medals in 1989 and 1991. So she is not lacking at all in the medals both at the world championships and at the olympics her personal best is 21.64 seconds which ranked number two all time back when she said it but is still number four all time to this day she has broken 22 seconds 16 times through her entire career which is the most of any woman in the history of the 200 meter dash and she also owns the world indoor record in the 200 at 21.87 seconds being the only woman to ever break the 22 second barrier indoors. She is ranked number one three times in her career and has amassed a plethora of accolades from 1980 all the way to 1997. So Merlene Audie comes in at my number two spot. Finally, at my number one, I have Allison Felix from the United States as my greatest women's 200 meter runner of all time. She is a three time Olympic medalist, winning silver in 2004 and 2008, and then she got that gold medal in London 2012. Five times she's won a world championship medal, winning three consecutive golds in 2005, 7, and 9, as well as a bronze medal in 2011. Her personal best of 21.69 seconds was number number four all time in 2012, but still sits at number six all time in the event. She has broken 22 seconds on six occasions throughout her entire career, which is the sixth most of any woman in the history of the event. Between 2003 and 2016, she is ranked number one on seven occasions in the 200 meters. So with all those accolades, the Olympic and world championship medals, the times and the number one rankings, Allison Felix comes up as my number one women's 200 meter sprinter of all time. So those are my top 10 women's 200 meter sprinters of all time. Again, this is just my personal top 10. So go in the comments below and let me know who your top women are in the 200 meters all time. Make sure you like the video, subscribe to the channel, and I'll be back again next time. Thanks.